Hello everybody, Avian Sola here, and today I'm going to be talking about a new series that we're starting, which will look at UK crimes and legislation, such as the Offence Against the Person Act, the Theft Act, Road Traffic Laws, and I'll also be covering some defences. So, I aim to keep these videos quite short, hopefully not more than 5 minutes each, however, I will include relevant case law, references and full information about the offences in each video's description. So you can always check there if you want more details. So let's start by looking at the very basics of what a crime actually is. And the Oxford English Dictionary defines a crime as an action or a mission which constitutes an offence and is punishable by the law. All right, it seems pretty simple really, doesn't it? But for an actual crime, there are three things that must be proven, and these must be proven by under reasonable doubt by the prosecution, as in the UK we work on the principle of someone is innocent until they're proven guilty. The first thing is the actus reus, this is the guilty act, and it's the actual act someone must commit that is against the law. Next is the mens rea, and this is someone's guilty mindset, and it looks at a suspect's state of mind. Did they intentionally commit a crime? Were they reckless as to create a crime? Maybe they were negligent, or is it an offence of strict liability? And we'll cover these in a future video. And finally, was there a lack of defence for the suspect? As I mentioned, it's up to the prosecution to prove all these, as in the UK, we work on the principle of someone is innocent until they are proven guilty. Now, I'm aware this has been quite a quick video, as I just wanted to announce this new series I'll be releasing and give you the basics about what a crime is and what's required for a crime to actually be committed. As with all new things, I'm not sure about it, so if you want to give me some feedback, maybe you've got some ideas, maybe you just want to let me know you'd be interested to see this content, drop us a comment in down below, hit the like button, maybe even hit the subscribe button if you don't want to miss my future content. It's all very much appreciated, thank you very much, and as usual, I hope you all have a very nice day.